This is a tutorial on how to map a network drive, like a Windows network drive, if you are running Mac OS. So if you're on a MacBook or an iMac um, and you're off campus and maybe you want to map into um, a network drive, for example, the College of Engineering shared drive or maybe the H drive, something like that, I'm going to show you how to do that. The first step you need to make sure you um, do is that you're connected to VPN. Um, that's with the Cisco AnyConnect. Uh, there's a link in the description if you haven't set up VPN on a Mac yet that'll walk you through how to set that up. Um, so once you're connected, you can actually map to network drives on uh, NMSU campus. So the way we're going to do that is we're just going to open up Finder. And um, <clears throat> it's pretty easy. You're just going to go ahead and up here at the top, you're going to click on Go and then Connect to Server. Okay. And then it's actually pretty easy. So um, it's a lot like Windows, except the slashes are a little bit different. Um, so for pretty much any network drive, you're just going to type smb colon forward slash forward slash, sorry, smb colon forward slash forward slash, and then um, the name of the server. So for this example, I'm going to go ahead and do our College of Engineering share drive. And then I know that it's shares dollar. Um, so I have the name of the server in the first part, and then I have the name of the folder I'm trying to access here. So then I'm just going to click connect and it's going to ask me, um, enter your name and password for the server. And so here's where we're going to erase what's in here. And we're actually going to use our, my NMSU credentials. So I'm going to type ACN backslash and my ACN username along with my, my NMSU password. And then you can see that I'm connected. And so here's like part of the engineering share drive. Um, you'll notice that we have some software available for students in here, stuff like that. Um, yours might look a little bit different than mine, depending on what you have access to. Um, but yeah, that's an easy way. And you'll notice here in locations that it mapped the network drive. So anytime I want to go to the server, um, I can click on, you know, over here and then get into the folder that I need to. Um, we're going to, I'll try this example again with like the H drive, just so we can uh, go through it one more time. So you're going to go to go, connect to server, and again it's just going to be smb colon forward slash forward slash and that server is known as avalanche. And then it's forward slash users dollar and then your username. So I'm going to do mine. And since it already had my username saved from the last one, um, it went ahead and signed me in with that anyway. And so here's some of my documents in my desktop from um, my Avalanche H drive. So very useful tools if you're on a Mac and you need to get into some Windows folders. Um, it doesn't require remoting in or anything like that. So you can just map it straight to your MacBook.